allowing me to join your reunion. Um, my name is Sari. I started life as Sari Carson. I've added a couple names since then. Um, and uh, I live in Washington, D.C. I've been living here since 1989. I have three children, none of whom are living in D.C. now. They're 21, 23, and 25, and they're all in the post-college, um, trying to figure out their life, uh, going to law school, taking on new challenges and work assignments. And it's very exciting to watch, but I miss them, and I'm sorry they can't be with me here today to learn more about their extended family. I grew up knowing about all you Kempners, and you're very lucky. I have a completely different perspective than you because you all come from this very nice, organized tree. You know that there are 10, there are 10 children from your grandfather's line, and you, you've been able to follow your family. It's been a lot more difficult for us because my grandfather, who basically is the same, my grandfather, Grandpa Jay Kempner, is basically the same age as your, as all Joseph's children. So you talk about your parents, and your parents are really the age of my grandfather. Um, unfortunately for my grandfather, his father, Mayor, who was the brother of Joseph, your your grandfather, uh, died at a very early age. I think he died about the same time my grandpa was born, and and a lot of the stories that I know are just so sketchy, and I only have little pieces, and nothing connects and nothing makes sense. And it probably won't make sense until I really spend considerable time studying it and trying to get more information. But the story is that my great-grandfather, Mayor, um, died when his horse carriage fell in the water and he got pneumonia and passed. And I know that he died the same year my grandpa was born, but then I was told that his wife was sent away that she had to remarry, she had to go to another town, so it was never, and I was told that he was raised by, my, by his grandfather, so that's his grandfather, who apparently raised him, and uh, there's my grandfather and his brother, Jack Kempner. Jack Kempner came to America, the two, my two, my grandfather and my uncle, they came to America together. They made their way across uh, Europe. They stayed actually with Herzogs in England. And my uh, Heinz Herzog told me during his life, he was telling me a story about how he would put my father on his, uh, sorry, how my grandfather would put tie him on his shoulders and carry him running around the house. But, uh, so, I don't, did never really learn much from my grandfather about his life in Europe. And then, um, my mother unfortunately died 13 years ago. And she was the keeper of the story in my family. So a lot of that is missing at this point. Um, so I grew up with the story of my grandfather and his uncle coming here to the United States. Uh, they settle ultimately in Chicago. And um, my, is that that's my grandpa? Uh, looks like in 1920, I don't know. Um, I think that's in the United States. You can come here next. So that's my great grandfather, who would be the brother of Joseph. So he's our great uncle. He's your great uncle. Um, when my uh, the story is that my grandpa did not want he was given an opportunity to go visit to go live with a couple different families. I think one in South Africa, I think one in Russia, and one in Chicago. He chose Chicago because he said they weren't as religious. And they ended up working in a, a relative store in Cicero, Illinois, 1921. And you can see how beautifully dressed, just like some of the other pictures wow. that we've seen. My, uh, I think the two, in, the, the number one on the right and number three are my uncle and my grandfather. Can go on. Now, uh, hopefully, can somebody is really here to tell me? Uh, I think this is Mayor. Can, can you tell me the name of this person? It is your trustee. Okay, so this, it's Fox V, is the father of Mayor, who is the brother. This is your great great uncle. Okay. I think it's bad luck to have the ma name Mayor in the family. Apparently so. <laughs> My grandpa got a picture from uh, London. He was supposed to come over on, with the wealthy, um, but but I never understood where the money came from. Where no details there. 
of my uncle Jack and his wife Minnie. You might have heard about Brian Kempner, who was supposed to be here. That's uh, his grandfather. My grandmother and grandpa, their wedding in uh, 1930. Do you know why they changed their name to Kempner? My grandpa went by Dave, middle initial P, Kempner. That was his. I don't remember. Um, my grandfather was a salesman. He bought everything with cash, his house, his car, his second house. We called him Cash Dave, <laughs> early 1940s. And my aunt, Marlene, my mother's sister, her wedding. My parents on the far right, my grandparents in the middle. My mom and I. So my mom's a Kempner. There's my mother again. My grandparents, I think, 50th anniversary. My grandpa lived, I think, to, I think it was 90, 90 when he died. So Brian's your cousin? He was, Brian was my first, uh, second cousin. Second cousin. Yeah. My grandfather was very, um, felt like it is. Could care less, but what he thought. Um, my mother's sister, Marlene, and her family. Lisa and Jordan, my first cousins. And um, last, summer? last summer, we had an 80th birthday party for my father. So this is my, my husband and I, and my three brothers, uh, Jay on the left, Ward in the middle, and Matt and their wives. And that's the four of us. And uh, my father and all of his grandchildren, except my daughter who was in Israel at that time. You can see there. Uh, grandchildren picture. And then, and then um, everybody except my brother Jake, because he was late. My brother Matthew. <laughs> my brother Matthew on the far left is the one that passed this summer. Grandchildren. And that's my, uh, my two sons. Evan is in Chicago in digital media. Ben's in San Francisco now in law school, just starting his teaching. And my daughter, Kara, who's in New Orleans now at, uh, with Abu Dhabi. Oh, really? My brother. Yeah. Sorry, finally shut up. He was there at the end. <laughs> but, uh, I, you know, it's uh, interesting to me because during my life growing up, I knew, I met Marco Kempner, I knew Stanley, um, I knew of Aviva and Jonathan, but now it's nice to see how you all fit in and I appreciate being able to be here with you. Thank you. My last commentary, another trip with my dad to Chicago, and I remember meeting Jack and Dave, they kept their brothers. And Brian, I've become very friendly with. And the thing I remember most distinctly is they were hilarious. They were known for their sense of humor. Very, very sharp, witty uh, uh, gentleman. My dad always was fond of them. So that pretty much wraps it up. Any final questions before we get to the Academy <coughs> Award winning movie? <laughs> Cap uh, uh, Captors and Plenty of Questions later at dinner. At dinner? Okay. So. Uh, just final comments. Uh, I think you have serious address. It's within a mile of here. It's very, very close. We're starting at six o'clock. If you need any directions, Sarah or Jerry, somebody can help you. Uh, the dress is always casual for everything. Tomorrow morning, uh, we have the brunch. I, some people at different times. We'll be ready from 10.30 on. If you come earlier, that's fine. Uh, the dogs do not bite. They get excited when someone comes in, but they do not bite, so don't be worried about that. I hear a lawsuit coming if they do. Um, and we'll go, everybody's invited, stay as long as you'd like, and we'll have typical uh, uh, deli type food. Uh, directions. 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 Got to put into your G, uh, GPA or uh, GPS. I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 hold, me aside, hold me aside tonight. I'll give you put it. I'll give you the address. It's about. I fell the GPA. <laughs> you need a GPA to use the GPA. Five hundred driveway. No, the driveway is under construction. 
Um, there's a whole story there which I won't get into. But just park on the street. There's plenty of parking on the street. You can just walk out. If so, like if, if we can make accommodations, if there's, uh, we'll work that out on the side. Look, look, look. Um, I would imagine come any time, I don't know, we'll start at 10.30, go until 12.30 or 1 o'clock if you're running late. Thank you. Oh, okay. Thank you, so with that, uh, do you want to introduce the film?